I was doing well in the 4x1 before that, and um, during a meet at spring break, I just begged my coach to run the open one because uh, it seemed fun. And then I ran 10:22. I mean, I knew I'd start getting more attention because it's more of like a like spotlight race, but I didn't know it'd be like this. All your barbs. Set. Uh, my start was pretty good, B plus, maybe A minus, but um, I, I, I don't know if it was bad, but if it was, I overcame it and had a good drive phase uh, for like 40 meters, got up, uh, got up tall, and I, I felt myself pulling away, um, and yeah, that's, that's basically it. <laughs> I definitely still think I can grow. Um, my acceleration phase, I think, is doing really well right now, but I still think I have a lot of room to grow on my start. Um, so that could definitely okay, get me right. under the 10 ones, 10 or something. It's crazy. I think about it like that sometimes too, but uh, it's weird too because like I ran really well in the 400 last year, but no one really noticed. And then as soon as I started running the 100, everyone's like, "Oh, we came out of nowhere." I'm like, "I mean, I ran the 400 last year." I saw they had a pretty decent lead, so I just went out fast. I didn't know if I would get him over there, but I just kept pushing. I felt myself to get up on him, and I heard the crowd yelling, so I was like, I'm just keep going. I was going to say, in that last 100, were you feeding off the crowd, kind of thinking about what you do in the 100 meter? Yeah. I wanted. To, I was tired. I was just like, oh, I'm done with this. And then I heard the crowd. I was like, oh, I guess I'm, I'm gaining on him, so I just went as hard as I could. Basically. Congratulations. Enjoy this. But one final thing. Where does this speed come from? My dad didn't even like do track. It's just hard work. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. Genetics, hard work, I don't know. Mixed.